Hey, what's up everybody? Tanvir here. Hope you guys are all doing well. A warm welcome to all of you guys in this first Adobe XD tutorial. Today, we are going to learn how to create and manage artboards in Adobe XD. So, let's jump into XD. So, this is the main interface of XD. This is the menu bar here. This is the layers and tools panel. And this is the inspector area. And this is the design mode. And this is the prototype mode where you can create prototypes to share design or where have interactions between artboards and this is the share option where you can create a share link of your design and share it to your friends or clients so now this is the artboard tool here so now let's create a new artboard when you will select the artboard tool from here you will see a few presets for mobile, tablet, web and desktop, social media and watch. This is really helpful for web designers or UX designers to create a artboard quickly. Suppose you want to create a Instagram story or Instagram post or YouTube video thumbnail. You just click on here and it will create a artboard for that so now let's create a web desktop artboard here you can see its height and width here you can easily adjust your artboard height and width by dragging these controls here like this it's pretty easy and you might have noticed this dotted line here this is basically the viewport height the viewport height is the screen size of any devices which you are going to see at the first sight so now let's talk about how you can rename your artboard just double click on this title here and rename it now here on the appearance section you can easily change or customize the fill color let's change the artboard color a little bit and also you can make it transparent by checking this icon let's keep it in white it looks good xd also have a built-in grid layout feature so you can see the grid in a square just like this most of the time we designers use the layout system also you can change the layout grid color from here this transparent color icons here if you want you can change the gutter width and column width from here you can adjust the margin from both of the sides change it here or if you want to apply different margins from both of the sides simply click on this icon and you can apply different margins from any side like this you can see the difference I will put it to 160 and in Adobe XD you can create as many artboards as you need just select the artboard tool here and just click any of it you can create a lot of artboards and let's talk about one more features of adobe xd let's zoom in a little bit so that you can see the at the top of here when i'm hovering here you can see the cursor changes you can drag and drop a line here 
like Photoshop so that you can rearrange or aligning any object in your artboard like this simply you can delete these lines here you can see the delete icon here just send it back to the edge of the artboard yeah and that's it so designers you guys can switch to Adobe XD because XD allows you to open a sketch or Photoshop files here now let's open a Photoshop file and I have design from my desktop here this one the document is loading just hold on for a while yeah here you go now here at the left corner select the layers panel here and select the canvas you will see the layered folders here you can select any assets fonts titles or shapes here and you guys can see all of the layer here and this is a Photoshop file now let's open a sketch file too let's open up the folder you can see this is the sketch file so let's open it document is loading hold on for a while so here you go you can see all of the screens here of the, of the light and dark version so now just select any of the artboard and select the images found here you can see the folders here at the layers panel you can easily customize the text here anything you can do anything you want here Adobe XD really useful so that's all for today I hope you like the video if you like the video then press the like button and subscribe to my channel I will see you soon in the next video of XD series. Meanwhile, you guys stay focused and keep learning.